Hey everyone, we are here at Experience Waterloo to get connected with their crew and to learn more about the upcoming events. Let's go. Hey. Hey, hey. How you that? doing? How are you? Good. All right. And for the people that are watching, can you tell them, I'll start with you, your name and title here at Experience Waterloo. Yep. Uh, so Tavis Hall, uh, Executive Director at Experience Waterloo. And I'm Lindsay Peters, Marketing Director at Experience Waterloo. And what exactly do you both do here? Uh, so Experience Waterloo, we're the tourism people. That's our, that's our, our base function, uh, is to welcome visitors uh, into our community. We view our role as a little different uh, from a lot of communities uh, and community or destination development organizations or destination marketing organizations. Um, we don't view it just as tourism, we view it as tourism plus. It is uh, you know, making sure that folks from outside of Waterloo have a, a positive view of Waterloo, but also making sure that folks that call Waterloo home are proud to do so. Uh, and so really trying to lean in uh, to, to strengthening community pride and making sure that folks are uh, you know, feeling good about here. Yeah. Yeah. Experience Waterloo is helping uh, get the word out through our website, through our community calendar, uh, through events, through uh, supporting local businesses to tell the story. And we're telling the story about Waterloo because we are so proud. And why would a resident give you a call or shoot you an email? Oh man, uh, so you know, if, if folks have you know family members coming into town, um, if they are looking to put on an event or wondering about what events are happening, uh, we tend to be a little bit in the know uh, when it comes to what events are happening throughout the, the community. And so, um, you know, there's a there's a slew of reasons we produce a visitors guide every year, but it's not just for visitors. Uh, it is also, I think it's really important for folks that are from here to have a full understanding of, of what it, what everything that we've got to offer uh, looks like. And so uh, definitely encourage folks to hit us up, check out the website. Uh, it's a great source of information, both from community calendar for, to directories, so you can figure out which restaurants, um, hotels, eateries, bars, any of it, retail establishments. We've got a lot to offer here. Uh, and so we just encourage folks to, to explore home as well. Yeah. And speaking of events, I know that y'all have some events coming up. Lindsay, could you talk a little bit more about what's happening? We are really excited to be taking over my Waterloo Days Festival. So uh, please come to our website and find out how you can volunteer, uh, be a vendor, got to sign up, be in the parade, which of course is that classic nostalgic piece of my Waterloo days. Um, it's going to be huge this year and we are so grateful to our sponsors for making that happen. Now my last question is, what do you all hope to make better while serving the city of Waterloo? Uh, really want to keep folks uh, feeling good about here uh, and, and folks that uh, you know, folks start to feel a little bit better about being here the more they know that it is here. Uh, the more that they experience the Grout Museum or the John Deere Museum, Center for the Arts, uh, Single Speed, Basil, Lost Island, right? We've got a lot of stuff going on here. Um, and so our goal is always to, to make folks feel better about Waterloo, whether they call Waterloo home or they call home from somewhere else. We're just so proud to tell the story, like I said, uh, and be sure and check us out as a resource for yourself or for a family that lives outside of town. Uh, we've, we've got a lot to offer here. Awesome. Thank you both. All right, everyone, that is it for Experience Waterloo. For more information, make sure you visit their website at experiencewaterloo.com. Stay connected.